There are seven extremely amazing signs that you're overindulging in sugar. I think the vast majority know the exemplary signs of eating a lot of sugar, which is fatigue, brain fog, excess fat, and a desire for carbs depressions. However, I really want to explain precisely what sugar is and the distinction between a carbohydrate and a sugar, since there's a great deal of disarray in the region containing similar complex carbohydrates. Or then again, straightforward starches or basic sugars like it's a major haze for a many individuals. A carb comprises of three things. Sugar, starch, and fiber. But starch is hidden sugar about which no one talks presently. Obviously you have like starch and vegetables, but you also get starch from them. In this or that part of this right here stuff here. So what really is sugar is fine. But starch is just a bundle of sugar associated together. Thus, the word that they use to depict it as poly, which refers to numerous SAIDs, implies sugar. So, while you're eating starch, you're really eating sugar. All right. And at the point when we discuss starch in the basic food item store, we're discussing this stuff. We are not powdered starch here. Discussing potatoes or vegetables, we're discussing ultra pris food calorie starch. And this starch will spike your blood sugar's way, way more than the actual sugar will have on the glycemic list. You have table sugar, which is 65. You have glucose, which is 100. However, there's starches like maltodextrin, which can go up to about 185. That resembles a greatly high spike. What's more, it's not simply maltodextrin. It's like altered food starch and changed corn starch, and it's well since you. Can you use corn to make starch? Seed oils from corn and you could make sugar, such as corn syrup or glucose syrup. Metric of corn syrup is available for purchase. Ton of corn for $198. Now, from that venture, the number of you could make boxes of cornflakes, and corn is used primarily to make cornflakes. While you're eating starch, you're really eating sugar, all right? And at the point when we discuss starch in the basic food item store, we're discussing this stuff. We are not powdered starch here. Discussing potatoes or vegetables, we're discussing ultra pris food calorie starch. And this starch will spike your blood sugar's way, way more than the actual sugar will have on the glycemic list. You have table sugar, which is 65. You have glucose, which is 100. However, there's starches like maltodextrin, which can go up to about 185. That resembles a greatly high spike. What's more, it's not simply maltodextrin. It's like altered food starch and changed corn starch. And it's well since you. Can you use corn to make starch? So some way or another, Cheerios, cornflakes, and even vegetable oils are not gone after for being unfortunate. Their heart sound. However, Meat, for instance, is attacked. That is, that will cause malignant growth. Yet anyway, I deviated from the point. However, I think it's critical to know that the greatest justification for ultra pris food, also known as low quality food, is huge benefit. Okay, so now, let's look at seven shocking symptoms that you're overindulging in sugar. Okay, number seven is diminished collagen. If you eat too much sugar, you will going to create less collagen and that will appear in free skin, more crumpled skin, and individuals that eat more sugar will progress in years rashly. Sixth, a persistent white tongue. So that you have a white tongue that simply doesn't appear to disappear. That is a type of candida as a result of overeating sugar. You're taking care of this parasite and it's proceeding to develop. I don't think you can dispose of this candida without dispensing with sugar from the eating routine, on the grounds that it adores these straightforward sugars, and 5. We get into constant sinus issues. Most constant sinus issues are an organism. Gillis is typically referred to as type, and that microbe really takes care of off of sugar as well. So again, I don't think you will have the option to dispose of an ongoing sinus contamination. Except if you completely abstain from sugar, as it continues to rely on the sugar you consume. Consume for red, or in the right way. Pink gums. You clean your teeth, 
and you see a little pink in the toothbrush. That is an extremely gentle rendition of scurvy, where, as a result of your vitamin C deficiency, at the point when you eat sugar, you block L-ascorbic acid. Furthermore, one spot that it shows up is in your gums. Okay, number three is low sugar will boost testosterone in the right way. Lower testosterone that can prompt erectile brokenness, decline drive, and also having trouble building muscle due to the fact that testosterone is involved. Number two, powerlessness to contamination. That is correct. Uh, having an excess of sugar will debilitate your safe framework to the point where you are more likely to be attacked. Secure a disease and the main a warning sign that you're consuming too much sugar. Furthermore, this is entirely astonishing. Elevated degrees of adrenaline and excessive amount of sugar harms the cell's capacity to make mitochondrial energy. And the way that the body makes up for that is by expanding adrenaline, not only for energy, yet to assist with assembling glucose and to make new glucose for fuel that is called gluconeogenesis. High adrenaline does not result from mental tension, but rather from actual pressure or stress that occurs in your cells. Since you're not ready to make sufficient energy, thus this is why it is possible to notice when you're exhausted that you have a great deal of apprehensive energy, fretfulness, that is the enormous side effect of a mitochondrial harm and a low vitamin B1 on the grounds. That the engine is vitamin B1 is a spark plug for broken help. Uh, initiate it. And the more sugar or starch, the greater the need for B1. What's more, and afterward, it sort of puts out the fire. So presently, you get this anxious energy. Or on the other hand, this lactic corrosive development. So this causes restless leg syndrome and insomnia. And furthermore, the adrenaline is going to influence your processing. And furthermore, increment thickening. In the body, coronary failure and stroke. Now, because I mentioned change, 